March. It is a crowded field to replace Congressman Bobby Rush in the 1st Congressional District. Nate Rogers joins us now with the latest on that. Nate. Yeah, that's right, Anthony and Tia. The 1st Congressional District here in Illinois is a historic one. I'm predominantly African-American, covering many portions of the south side of Chicago and the south suburbs. Congressman Bobby Rush served in the seat for some 15 terms, announcing earlier this year that he would not run again. Rush is endorsing Karen Norrington Reeves and joined her at a south side polling place today. Reeves is CEO of the Chicago Cook Workforce Partnership. 21 candidates are vying for the seat. Many big names in Chicago, including Alderman Pat Dowell, State Senator Jacqueline Collins, activist Jamal Cole, also Jonathan Jackson, the son of civil rights activist Jesse Jackson. Just a short time ago, we spoke to Hyde Park businessman Jonathan Swain, who's also in the race. He shares these issues as key concerns for residents. I hear three things. One, people want to feel safe. They don't feel safe. They want to make sure that their health care is affordable because, you know, they're concerned about losing their homes if they get sick. And people want to uh, deal with the rising cost of inflation, cost of gas and cost of groceries and things of that nature. And one or two ways where you're able to assist with that. I mean, when it comes to safety, it's about developing plans and resources to ensure that we're able to make the investments we need to ensure our young people are involved and we can um, and mental health issues are dealt with so we can increase safety in all of our communities. Now, Republican candidates on the ballot include Eric Carlson, Phyllis White, Jeffrey Wigner, and Gino Young. We have spoke to voters who've told us with so many different candidates on the ballot, they're really unsure how this race will turn out. Of course, we'll con continue to follow this race, the first congressional district, all day long, and we'll be sure to update you on air and online as soon as those numbers start coming in. We're live on the city's south side, Nate Rogers, Fox 32 Chicago.